brothers to the, you know, the, the last piece of whatever was available on the plate or, um, you know, to get the best skates and the skating bag or the best skis. I guess you don't know what skates and skis are down here. But, <laughs> um, but I just think um, running is a very personal thing. Um, it's very important to, to have your own goals. I mean, my goal was to make it into the Olympics as a ski racer, and then I broke my race, my like ski racing, and I um, following year I tried to get back in the starting gate, and I was just holding back, and you know, in ski racing it's no guts, no glory, and um, I'd done all this running to rehab, and I just loved it, and so I just stayed with it, and um, I ran because I loved it, and. As I said, the longest distance was the 1,500 meters when I started. I didn't have a clue that the IOC was going to accept the Olympic marathon as an event for women in my day. And it just so happened that I was in the right place at the right time. And um, I just really am blessed to be surrounded by so many close family members and friends who supported my effort. I mean, when I was growing up, dinner was served at 6 and you weren't a minute late or else you got in big trouble. And by the time the Olympics rolled around, dinner was being served at 7, 7.15, 7.30 because my mother knew I was so passionate about pursuing this dream. And back then, um, I was running twice a day, BC. Um, I'd run in the morning and I'd run in the afternoon. And the three key workouts for marathoning, and I think this probably would be good advice for all of you, um, even though your times and distances might be slightly different. The three key workouts are a long run, a medium long run, and some sort of a speed workout. And I try to um, space those three runs equally throughout the week. And my long run is pretty much at the end of the week, and I run however I feel on that particular day. I don't, very rarely do I check my watch or wear my watch on a training run, but just go with what you have left at the end of the week. The medium to long run is the run I really push. And then the track workout is where I wear my watch or a fartlek workout or a tempo run or whatever it is. But I think those are three three critical workouts per, per week. For me, my long run was 20 miles. For some of you, it may be 15 miles and your long run your medium long run may be eight to 10 miles, but you know what, what works for you and you may build up to longer and longer distances. But there's also, um, and that's starting three weeks before, three months before the actual marathon date. So I, I pinpoint the marathon that I wanna run and then I count back three months and that's when I start my workouts. Um, my brother, I had a brother who's a doctor, he hops on me.